Welcome to getting started in Fronter. The first thing that I advised you to do is look up at here where your name comes up. You can see mine says Mr. Arda. Your first name may appear here on your contact card. So you may have to change this to Miss or Mrs. or Mr. That's appropriate or Doctor if you are. And then you need to save that. This is to prevent students from actually seeing that you have your first name up there. So having clicked save, I come back to here, this today page. We're going to create a room. The drop down arrow shows you how we've laid out all of the learning areas in line with the new school. Going down within the scroll bar, we can see that there are plenty of class lists and spaces which are prepared for learning. But all the way at the bottom is create new room. When we click on to here, we are able to choose the corridor in which we are going to put our new room. So I can scroll down and you can see that there are the different areas such as the uh, discoveries hub or health and well-being we can see there, humanities, language and communication and sound and vision. For this example I'm going to actually select the training corridor where we have our setup but you could have chosen any one of the uh, learning hubs to create your room. So now I've selected the corridor I give that room a name. The duration can be left blank and I will just put in a welcome here. Within this text editor you can highlight the text, choose to change the font size or the style even. The size is here and you can change the alignment so we can center it which probably would be useful to put it in the middle of the page. So we'll change the color of the text and just leave that there. Now with regards to the tool package we have to use something which is specific to our school. So in this case we have 5461, the one at the bottom. So we will select that. We are happy with all of the options so we will save at this point. Now you can see that the room has been created. We need to customize this. So there is a drop down menu. We click on to here and we go to customize tool package because we need to create a front page. So within the set of menus under the tools we can click on to new tool and from here as I progress down you can see that there's a front page. So for our room we want a front page for our students to see which provides links to other pages. Having ticked front page, I can now move to the bottom, click on to save, and this will create it. If you noticed, rewinding back in the video, front page has now appeared here. We need to shift the position of this front page towards the top, so then that means this will be visible to students and to anyone else. And we are able to move the position of it towards the top with this arrow here. You can see it starts to progress up here as well as in the tool menus here. Need to keep on going. Almost there. And there you are. So at the moment we've chosen the tool which is front page. Now that we have modified this, we can click on to save. You can see up here, it's now changed to Mr. Artist's front page. So if we click on to here, we can see that our front page is ready to edit.